two amino acids. Well, not two of them. It's called a two amino acid. That's the carboxylic acid grouping there. That hydrogen ion can come off. And there's the amino group there. Those hydrogens don't normally come off. It's basic. So that's amino and that's acid. So where does the two come from? Well, the second carbon, one and two, has this R group coming off. And that's where the two comes from in a two amino acid. Well, if you take a look at the periodic table, you won't find what R is. R isn't an element. It's not an element. But it does give the amino acid its uh, unique properties, and it's different for each of these amino acids. Let's look at a few examples. If R is just simple hydrogen, then that's called glycine. If R is the methyl group, that's called alanine. You don't have to learn these, it's just different examples. And finally, if you have another carboxylic acid group on there, that's called aspartic acid.